Have you ever heard about charging your car while you drive? Or something called dynamic charging? Well, this new technology will allow electrical cars, trucks, and buses to charge during the move. Now, the biggest hurdle to electrical car adoption are the battery range and charging availability. But if cars could wisely charge while they drive, it will resolve this issue. Consumer will have no reason to feel hesitant about buying an electrical vehicle. So let's talk about this technology. Welcome to Game Changer Tech. Well, several different companies and research teams are working on developing and testing dynamic charging, which may solve the problem of battery range and keeps the electrical vehicle batteries joined up. So what is dynamic charging? Well, dynamic charging works via underwood pads, or we call it coils, that transmit electricity wirelessly to receiver mounted underneath the vehicle. Energy from these coils are transferred to vehicle batteries through magnetic induction as the vehicle travels along the road. The charging system does require the control unit to be located on the side of the road and a receiver installed in the chassis of each vehicle. One of the companies that are currently working on this technology is Election. As part of its 2020 test in Tel Aviv, Election wirelessly charged a Renault Zio with 8.5 kilowatts while driving. Although the company claims the charge power could rise to 15 kilowatts, the closer the two coils are together, the more efficient the transfer is. Election also announced it had successfully completed a transfer rate of 70 kW over one mile long off road in Sweden, where it had trialed its dynamic wireless charging system. And it's also planned to test another pilot project in Italy. Well, it could be a total game changer, minimizing time wasted at charging station and eliminating range anxiety. At the moment, charging stations are a big concern for EVs. According to University of California Davis Research, one in five electrical car owners switch back to gas-powered car because of the charging hassles, like having to find charging points and wait for a long time. Plus, there aren't even enough charging points per EV on the road. As it stands, there are around 1.8 million battery-powered cars on the US roads but only approximately 100,000 charging plugs at about 41 public station location. However, electrifying transportation is understandably at the top of the priority list for solution to decarbonize the American economy, since 60% of this country greenhouse gases emission comes from transportation sector. In the US, the Indiana Department of Transportation IDOT partnered with Bordeaux University and German company called Magmin to test a new high-tech street that automatically charge batteries on EVs equipped with a particular receiver. If testing is successful, IDOT plans to expand. Magmin says the product has a 95% efficiency rate, a high degree of thermal conductivity, can withstand all weather conditions, doesn't cost more to use than standard road building materials and is safer from vandalism. But the US isn't alone in this mission. Many European countries have also prioritized transport electrification. For example, Germany expects up to 10 million EVs on its road by 2030, and is testing electrical highways around Frankfurt, Hamburg, and Stuttgart. Sweden also plans to build around 1,500 miles of electrical road by 2037, as part of its plan to reach zero net emission by 2045. A consortium led by German car maker Volkswagen will develop and implement a project called eCharge that would see electrical cars charge as they drive via the road. But how did this idea come up? Actually charging without plugging in is already commonplace for smartphones, but it is still something of holy grail for EV makers. While wireless charging an electrical vehicle while parked is similar to today's smartphone setup, the idea of charging while driving is more challenging. Dr. Nikolai, the head of Volkswagen Group Innovation, said inductive charging could be used in all vehicle segments, from cars to trucks, 
And with this project, we want to understand the technology better and examine its possibility in comparison to the alternatives. Well, amongst the issues to be tested under this project are road integrity and connecting the wireless road charging system to renewable energy sources. Another issue to be analyzed under this program is how to integrate the vehicle with the charging system and build a driver for the energy used. This technology potential is limitless, apart from the elimination of range anxiety and time-consuming conventional charging, it will make electrical vehicles much more efficient, especially those intended for commercial use. The automotive industry will be able to develop smaller batteries, which in turn will lead to cheaper and more spacious vehicles. It would also literally pave the way for more sustainable transit. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you like it. And I'll see you in the next one.